Welcome guys, welcome back to Mac Truck Simulator. Oh, I didn't hit the wrong button already. Uh, we're on 1.4.1. It has finally a I hit it again, I'm trying to get the map back. Um, it has finally released. There we go. So we're up in um, San Francisco. We're going to go up the rating. We got some fruit juice. We're using SCS's uh, T680. With their, one of their trailers. Now some of the trailer mods are not working on 1.4.1. I'm on my first profile. We got 274 miles to go. So let's get on the road. Uh, if you, one of the things that did happen in 1.4.1 is they did reskin California. California is totally different. Uh, this area looks the same. I don't see too much difference over here. Um, they did bring convoy. Which is awesome. I mean, I'm not, I don't play multiplayer that much, so it probably won't be something that I'll use too much. Turn left. But it's good to have it, you know, in the game. Good to see the progress that SCS has made, you know. Uh, the camera system, I will show you the camera system. I will show you some of the other features that was added into right. the uh, game in, in this version. Uh, we're, we're probably we're getting very close most likely to uh, Wyoming coming out so it'll be coming probably very soon uh, my second profile as of right now uh, the coast coast map is not working so I'm gonna have to wait for that to update hope everyone's doing well hope you um, enjoying the videos I do apologize for no uploads I've uh, been busy I'm trying to get where I can do it more. That is my whole goal is to get in here where I can do this every day. That's what I want to do. You know, not just ATS, you know, different games. A lot of other Keep stuff left. that I want to work on. And then so. turn left. You know, I want to get in where I can start doing you know, live left. streams and stuff every night, you know. Every night. Or not every night, but here in the week, yeah. It's been a challenge. Try to keep things going. Still using the same engine pack. You know, it is working fine. It is an older engine pack. It's uh, from version 1.3.9. Um, this engine pack does not replace the engines. It just replaces the sounds of the engine. That way. Yeah, if I decide I don't want to use the engine pack, I can just remove it, and the truck still works. You don't have it doesn't crash. It doesn't. Um, you don't have to buy another truck. You don't have the, the issue of it crashing. You know stuff like that. So that's really why I use it. I like it better that way, and it still works. So we're gonna close that map up here just a minute. And we hit the wrong button again. There we go. Um, I I have got a track R, uh, but I don't have a camera. I gotta wait till I get a, a camera, a webcam. I don't have a webcam, so I'm working on doing that so I can sit up my track R. have said this is a beautiful game um, today ETS 2 1.4.1 did release you will be, you will see both videos I'm gonna post it most likely I'm gonna post it on both channels just get the feedback on it oh, I like the like the water and maybe like clouds or something that. That's pretty cool. Um, and Barris, if you want to see more of the coast to coast stuff, you know, let me know. Um, some of the maps are not that good. Um, and you know, let me know what you what you know about 1.4 um, Wyoming. You know, there's been talks of new companies coming out. We're gonna go this way. I don't like when I'm recording. Well, I don't know. We might not be able to get through there. Okay, we're gonna have to back it. Yeah. I hate to do it, 
point one when recording, but we're gonna have to. I'd rather go do it, but you know, I need to just turn it off and not okay. wait to turn it off. I always get to turn it off when I get ready. So that is my fault. But I hope you're enjoying the videos. Hope you're enjoying the content. I, I do apologize for the lack Keep of content. Right. It's and not something that I want. Right. Always looking for new stuff to play. Always and looking for right. ideas of stuff to get into. Um, I've got some ideas of some stuff that I've been playing. I want to start over for turn you guys. Left. And then turn left. Um, stuff that I've been looking at. And I, I, I do appreciate everyone the feedback and everything that I'm getting from flashing lights, um, you know, and stuff like that. So, turn left. It's probably gonna tell us we're gonna have to go. Oh, well, hang on, man, I'm not gonna do that. Let me look at the map because we're not gonna do that. Because most likely it's gonna make us turn around and go back up here and turn around again. So we're not gonna do that. We're going to reading. Let me see if there's another way. Uh, maybe we can do it this way. I'm, I'm looking to see real quick. I don't see where it's going to make us turn around, so maybe that'll work. Sometimes you get on there and it'll make you turn again, turn around, and keep you keep going in circles because the, the, the road being blocked, I don't want to do that, so. But I hope everyone's doing well. I hope you've been enjoying this, the, the videos. I've, I've been enjoying it. Um, I, and I get questions all the time, guys, about modern trucks. I do use them. Um, I'm not using them right now on the second profile because I knew the uh, 1.4.1 was going to be coming very soon. So I did get rid of all of them because most of the time when a new update comes out for this game, mod trucks don't work and it takes a while for the models to update them. So I kind of I kind of wait until all that you know until they're updated and everything like that. Then I'll start getting some more put back in, or either I just won't use them. I don't use them much. Um, I get this question asked to me all the time about why. Uh, nothing against modded trucks. These modders, they do an awesome job. They, you know, they keep this game alive. You know, the truck the trailers, all the stuff that they do, they, they keep this game going. But I prefer these trucks over a modded truck. If you put a, right, a good engine sign in these trucks, these trucks are good. I mean, they're well made. And this one needs to be redone. I would really like to see SCS come in here and redo the 389, the Peterbilt, and the Kidworks, and the ball. They need to be re, reworked with better interior and all that. Because they, they're, of uh, the interior wise and everything, these are the, the worst of trucks. Go straight on. And it's because right. of the oldest trucks. They've been in the game the longest. And, and I understand that. So. Take a look at the truck. And once we do get uh, track of our work, and these mirrors will be disappeared. We won't have these. Uh, not using no graphics card, just using default graphics. Not using like any kind of graphics mod. And then, like, yeah, just using. I mean, they have really improved the graphics a lot. I really like what I'm seeing, you know. And the day the truck's running a Cummins high 600 and with an 18 speed, even full of transmission. Go straight on. That's right. We'll get a thumbnail here. Alright, this is what I want to show you with the thumbnail. They've changed the thumbnail, the uh, photo center here, the photo station. All this, you know, is the same here. You can uh, kind of go. I don't like the fact. Okay, there it goes. 
Like, if you want to go and like this, but what you can do now, you can change your time of day and weather while you're driving. If you want it to be like night, like this, or well, like that, completely dark, or you want to like change the clouds like that, and you can even do weather. You know? Which is pretty cool that they added that little feature in. We're going to do sunny. Well, I think that would look good, don't you? We'll take that picture right there. So, a neat little feature. Uh, I will talk about Convoy from what I know once we drop this load. Uh, unload this uh, juice. This is some fruit juice. Slow down, we're gonna be going too fast here. Now I am still using a controller. I don't have nowhere to put a wheel. I wish I did. I really would rather use a wheel for this, but I don't have really no have nowhere really to put one. Also, guys, if you're interested, check out our groups. I mean, I've got multiple ATS groups, um, and they're doing very well. The ones that I have are doing well. We've started some more. Um, I had some groups that wasn't doing anything, and I, I, I didn't want right to just remove them. Right. I just want to make them something that I thought that would get members. And ATS is the one game right. that does get members in groups. There's just so many people that plays it. You're always going to get members. You can have 15 groups and you're going to get members. It's just that simple. Keep right. You would not think that, but that's the way it is. Going to try to get in and start doing a little more live streams. I really want to get into doing more. Um, LSPDFR is working again. I did have to go back down to Jurisdiction 3, unfortunately. For I some reason, um, DLC files are not working. Oh, my controller just come undone. I need to take care of that. Sorry about that. Alright, sorry about that. My controller come undone. I had to go back down to Jurisdiction 3, like I said, with LSPDFAR, I mean, you guys watch the LSPDFAR. Uh, for some reason, the DLC files are not working. I've got a game configuration file in and everything, and it just will not register and add on vehicles. I don't know. I, I don't know what happened. It was working fine, and it just stopped. So. It's a new one on me. I mean, I, I don't know what, it, what that is. Just be honest with you. Excuse me. Go straight on. That's right. So hopefully, you know, one, uh, a coast to coast and the Canada map will get updated. I'm thinking that I have a second profile that I use for that, and it's crashing when you go and start going to other um, states that's not SES states. So I'm thinking that, you know, that's what the reason is. So hopefully, you know, all that get updated is we can get back in and do our second profile. You know, and let me know what uh, Coast to Coast map y'all use. I use the one that I found on one of my mod sites. Um, I don't use them a lot because, I can be honest with you, it's bare. Um, the one, this one here, not a lot. I mean, and I understand that. I understand, you know, it is a mod. It's a pre-mod, and I'm not complaining, you yeah. know. I'm not complaining at all. I mean, I'm glad to see that someone makes that coast to coast map. You know, that's, that's great. You know, hats off to the, you know, developers uh, of it, you know. It's 
CHP hiding over in the bushes, over where the trees and whatever. We'll see you sitting over there. And uh, don't know if we're going to get any trucks this year. I, I would love to see another truck come this year for ATS. I know they released two for ETS too. Um, I have not seen one yet for us. We may not get one this year. Just bounce me. If we do, it'll be late in the year. They did say there was some coming, but as of now, they have not released it. Released it. We're running all of Jazzy Cat's mods. We're running Traffic Master, his stuff, our Traffic Machines mods. Um, we're running all of his Traffic mods to look at. It's actually running pretty well. It, it does have a little bit of a lag every once in a while. Um, that could be just over mod, and I need to look at the, some of the mods and see, you know, what what may be causing it. Could just be the game too, you know, not optimized good enough too, because I don't have any issues with other ones. So. pop the map up here. I do it every time. We got 72 miles to go. Take one more look at the truck trailer. Now that's the mod too guys that I'm using, it gives you the 3D uh, destruction icons like these signs and stuff like that. You can find that over on the workshop, it looks really good. doing well uh, I've already said that I know but I hope everyone's doing well hope you've been enjoying the content um, and I do apologize like I said for lack of content it's not what I, what I prefer it's uh, you know I have other things I have to do um, currently yeah, I'm looking for more employment opportunities uh, until I can really build this channel like I want it I mean I want the, you know, this channel to grow I want to see it grow and I'm trying to get a job that gives me the opportunity to work on it um, like I need to and that was the issue with a lot of the ones I've had the scheduling just was bad and I could not get in here and spend the time that I need to spend to keep this channel going but yeah I am liking what I'm seeing with the re rescaling and everything. California it looks good. Go straight on. That's right. Yeah, I, I'd like to know where they're gonna go next. You know, after Wyoming comes out, after Texas comes out, cause which we know we may not even see Texas this year. We may. Uh, that's. That's still being questioned when we'll actually see Texas this year. But, you know, where do you think they'll go next? You, do you think they'll go Montana? You know, do Montana next? Or to Wyoming? No. I mean, which way do you think they'll go? I might know. You know, leave me, leave me your comments. You know, let me know. What do y'all think? I 
hope the graphics are okay for you guys. Let me know if the graphics are not that good. I'm still kind of working on that too. It looks pretty good on my side, but you know, I don't know how to, I'll have to watch the video and see what y'all are saying. Because to me it looks pretty good, so. Alright, we're in Reading. It's right here on the next exit. Keep right, and then exit right. Uh, talking about trucks, though, I really would like to see the Exit new right. Kenworth and the new uh, uh, 579, the new the next gen T680 and 579 come. I think that would really that would right. be better than we're reworking these. I mean, just replace these trucks with that, which they won't do, but you know, I'd like to see that. Take this wide turn. Taking this to Target, I believe. We're uh, finished. We're going to Walmart. I don't know why they want fruit juice like this, but okay. Still using the real company mod. It's on the workshop. Um, really do like it. Uh, highly recommend it. I know there's other ones out there. Uh, this one actually gives you more. It gives you more options. This actually gives you. Um, there's a, it gives it renames a lot of the like little convenience stores. It renames the uh, hotels. Um, it does like the restaurants. It makes you real, real known restaurant names. You know stuff like that. So. It's really a really nice mod, you know, and if anyone can afford, you know, to go over and donut to, to them, you know, to keep it going, that's great, you know. Right here. We're taking fruit juice. You know, and I get questions too about this right here, guys. But you know, you just have to kind of go with it with the way the game is. Uh, obviously, you know, in real life, you wouldn't really bring in fruit juice in a truck like this to Walmart. But you have to kind of go with the game, and that's the way the game is. Uh, we don't have drops for everything. You know, there, there, there's just no location. For so, you know, sometimes the drops don't make sense. But you know, you just have to, you have to go with it and just have fun. And, and that's what it's all about. Driving some beautiful trucks across this across this great country and having a good time. And, and that's what it's about. And I know most of you like the other bag game, but like I said, I don't have a track R, and it would be almost impossible for me to do it from the inside without one. Had to jack half it here. Get in here straight. Now I have multiple profiles on here too, so there we go. Yeah, that's pretty straight. Alright, 
right, we drove excellent. We drove 281 miles. Took us six hours, 15 minutes to get here. We consumed 38.5 gallons of fuel. We'll probably go ahead and just get a load here. Same thing, fruit juice and milk. Oakland, California. That's a long one. Alright guys, that's going to be it for the video. I'm going to show you that about the convoy real quick. Um, so you can kind of see the, the menu and stuff for that. That's going to be it for the video today. Just want to get in here and you know show the, a little bit of the update for 1.4.1. .1 and uh, a little bit of the reskinning of California. We're going to be look, taking a look at it more. I'm going to try to stay in California for a little bit and just kind of go through and look at it more. But, you go to your menu... And I can't do it because I have mods. It's going to tell you now. You cannot join Convoy with mods installed. So, you cannot get into a multiplayer with mods. So, you have to enable all your mods. And then you go here where it says Convoy. And you will set up your mod. Your Convoy. But, I mean, pretty much all the other menu is the same. They just added that. Um, everything else is pretty much the same. So, thank you for watching, thank you for subscribing, and have a good day.